Let's move to other news now. Two people are dead after a violent wrong way crash in Westminster. One person was injured. Police say a minivan was going the wrong way when it crashed into three other vehicles. KTLA Orange County Bureau Chief Chip Yost is live at UCI Medical Center in Orange with more. Chip. Yeah, Sharon Pedro, right now there's a 75-year-old woman here at UCI Medical Center fighting for her life. We spoke to her daughter a little earlier who said this is an example of how quickly life can change. One minute, her mom was getting ready for an upcoming cruise. The next minute, she was in the back of an ambulance being rushed to the hospital. She was um, the matriarch of our family. She was all of our biggest cheerleaders. And so now it's time for us to be hers. Outside UCI Medical Center in Orange, Laura Herzog took a few minutes to tell us about the status of her 75-year-old mom, Vicki, who survived a head-on wrong-way collision in Westminster Monday afternoon that left two others dead. She is in critical condition. Um, she's got multiple breaks and multiple injuries from, from the vehicle accident. The collision happened on Beach Boulevard near Roosevelt when a van driven by an 84-year-old man, for some reason, veered into oncoming traffic straight into Vicky's car. The driver of the van was pronounced dead at the scene, while a 75-year-old woman in the van with him was later pronounced dead at the hospital. Vicky, meanwhile, was also rushed to the hospital once firefighters got her out of her car. Now the whole family is praying she pulls through. I'm just asking anyone who's watching this, my mom, her name is Vicky, and I just ask that you pray and that you just pray for her and her recovery and um, pray for the family of, of the, the, the man, um, um, the driver of the vehicle that hit my mom. Just ask that you pray for him. I understand that he passed and so did his wife. I just pray for that family um, as they grieve. And I ask that you pray for my mom, Vicki, as she works really hard and fights for her life to recover um, from the injuries that she sustained in the accident. Police have not yet released the names of the two people killed in this collision. And as you heard there, Vic, Vicki, uh, Laura's mom, still fighting for her life here at the hospital. For now, reporting live at UC Irvine Medical Center, I'm Chip Yost, KTLA 5 News. We are wishing her the best tonight. Thank you, Chip.